Joe Albertson is known for doing the common thing uncommonly well. He accumulated a great wealth of knowledge and formulas for success as he built the Albertsons empire while finding fulfillment that comes from setting monumental goals and achieving them. His family moved to Caldwell, Idaho in 1909, where Joe grew up and went through school. After graduating from Caldwell High School in 1925, Joe studied business for two years at the College of Idaho in Caldwell. In 1927, while still at the college, he began his career in the grocery industry as a clerk at a local Safeway store. In 1930, Joe married his college classmate Catherine McCurry of Boise. Joe quickly moved through the ranks during his career with Safeway until he was supervising more than a dozen stores. But he was not satisfied and wanted to start his own store, one that he could build to his own specifications and manage his own way. With $5,000 of the money he and Catherine had saved, and with $7,500 borrowed from his wife's aunt, Bertie, Joe formed a partnership with L.S. Skaggs, a former Safeway division manager, and Tom Cuthbert, Mr. Skaggs accountant. Joe's first store was founded in 1939 on three simple principles, quality, good value, and excellent service. He is credited as being one of the pioneers of the complete one-stop self-service supermarket concept. Joe opened his second and third Albertson stores in Nampa and Caldwell, Idaho in 1940. During the years of World War II when food was being rationed, he filled the empty shelves with health and beauty products, general household goods, and other non-food items. His reputation for generosity and involvement grew during those war years. His stores prompted war bonds and sponsored scrap drives that collected aluminum, steel, and paper for recycling. During the 1950s and 60s, Albertsons became a familiar name to shoppers throughout the West. Joe and Catherine established the J.A. and Catherine Albertson Foundation as a way to administer their charitable giving and have given more than $240 million to Idaho's communities and education systems. Joe Albertson's life was filled with enjoyment of the rare but simple pleasures, fishing a mountain stream, going hunting with friends, and enjoying the company of his family.